Oh wow, look at me being productive while I record. Guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we are finally messing around with the new Gear Falcon. I know in the Vela's X video, a bunch of people told me the way I should have done it is with the Gear Falcon Repulsor Brace. We didn't actually do that. However, for today's video, I did manage to get a sidearm, because that name is hard to pronounce. With Killing Wind and Repulsor Brace, this thing has Polygon, Rifling, Ricochet Rounds, Killing Wind, Repulsor Brace, and Stability. Originally, I wanted to review this thing, and I was waiting until I got a kill clip roll, and then I realized, after all the comments in the Vela's X video, that I should actually be looking for a Repulsor Brace Gear Falcon build. So this sidearm, I think, kind of fit into it perfectly. The last time I used Gear Falcon was before the rework, and I used it with Rat King, so I'm hoping this has a similar type of feeling. Those of you that don't know, Repulsor Brace, defeating a Void debuff target grants an overshield. This synergizes incredibly well with the Gear Falcon because your Void weapons gain volatile rounds after you emerge from being invisible. None of the other stuff works in PvP, but that's the important thing. So we dodge, we shoot to break our invis, and we have volatile rounds. It also grants us an overshield with the Furotura. Uh, and for the sake of that, we are going to play Rumble. I know Rumble can be boring at times, it only goes up to 20 kills, but I do think Rumble is like the perfect playlist to try this out. So yeah, thank you so much for letting me know in the comments about the Vela's X. If you have any other ideas for upcoming videos, please do let me know, and I'll catch you in the next one. Okay, first game. Let's try this out. We got Exodus Blue. Very nice. So I'm thinking I just dodge and spam an SMG. Wait, Heek? Is that actually him? Wow, a shotgun. What do you want, you little bitch? I'm gonna get you. Very nice. Oh, no way I shot that, right? Surely not. Come on, give me the volatile kill. There we go. So I, wait, I didn't get an overshield? Why is that? I'll yoink that, thank you. Gotta be bottom there. There we go, now we got the overshield and start executioner. Oh, so now I see how strong chaining this will be if I can actually get it going. There we go. I need to make sure I sh stop shooting at the right time to actually chain it though, because I'm pretty sure just shooting one one bullet too many is what's ruining this for me. At least the invis portion. Oh, it's sheep. My worst enemy. Oh wow. Look at me being productive while I record. Okay, I feel like I'm not showcasing the perk too well, but just like, has a gun in the zone, kind of popping off. Oh shit! Okay, yeah, it's gone nuts. Is that only us two? Where is everyone? There we go. No, oh, what the fuck? I'm stupid. I'm getting so like ready to stop shooting that I'm not even focusing on getting the full kill. Uh, 
catch someone that's not expecting me. There it is. But yeah, getting the wall hack and stuff, like, this does seem insanely strong, in Rumble in particular. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> Just backflipped and killed me. Yeah, GG's to the boy Sheik. Check his channel out if you haven't seen him already. I'm sure a lot of you are familiar with his content. Good friend of mine. Great creator. Let's get into another game. Okay. <clears throat> a longer range map, so we're going to have to try and force the close fights. But things I'm going to be invisible for the majority of it. it. Might not be that hard to do. What the fucking Titan? Bro, you see how I'm trying to make sure I stop shooting early enough? Almost getting me killed. Body shuttable. There we go, full street. We can get invis here ready for this guy. Dude, that guy is terrifying. Okay, yeah, this is crazy. This is legit my second game with this. That's no time. I'm not close enough for that. There it is. But why am I not getting true sight there? Did I not stop shooting early enough? I feel like I did that time. No. You know what? I'm alive. That's what matters. I'm also stuck in spawn with no range, dude. Fuck. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We can talk about this, bro. Hmm, I guess you have to be like right when you come out of Invis to get the volatile buff. I'd only run out for like a second there and I didn't have it. This is really good though. Good chase. This is very Titan of you, sir. I'm dead. Oh, inner accuracy. What? That guy is a wizard. He's crouching. So can you not do it more than once? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Oh my god, he almost gunned me. There we go. Game two, we won. We managed to get close enough that the sidearm worked. Volatile also is going to make your range effectively feel longer. We went 22 and 3 in the second game. Maybe one more rumble and then quick play. I'm not sure yet. <clears throat> okay, we found ourselves in a 6v6 game on Endless Veil. I'm actually going for the double, like, invis perks now instead of status execution. I want to get that invis uptime really good and just make sure I have Volatile on pretty much every kill and I can keep getting the overshields. I just got stuck across the map, bro. There's one, we have an overshield. Left the flank here, but they're probably all gonna turn. I got stuck again. Bro, keep these nades away from me. I was getting this. There's one. I'm gonna chase. He did. That guy's one shot. I have any invis right now. Kill, we gotta back up. There's one, I'm volatile right now. Oh, I have a tractor cannon. Oop. Get that overshield. Oh, I didn't get that chase in time. He rifted close. There's three. This guy in that rift, I've got to drop. We have an overshield still. Oh, this guy is just dead. Oh, wait. I must be able to see his feet. Hi. I was going to say, there's no way you can put a shield on there, get full coverage. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, we got him. Get an overshield for free. Thank God my teammate was shooting him as well. We have a tether, but tether sucks. To put it simply. Oh, we're kind of popping off now. Is that a toilet? We're gonna. Oh no, I'm dead. 
I didn't shoot. No, I thought I was going to get two there. Oh my god, I almost choked that. There's one. I think I'm dead there. Wait. Hold on a minute. No, I tried to get out. I had to kill the sidearms, actually. I mean, I guess that's just all sidearms. But it's really, really fast. I will take three. There was two running at me behind. I thought I could do the 180 and shotgun one. I didn't know there was two there. I'm about to have a tether. Can I get one tether kill in this whole video? Like four game players. Can I get a kill with tether? Can we get any value? Wait a minute. Wait. Yes. It happened. Finally. I have an overshield. Kill volatile rounds as well. I don't really have the range for this. Run through it. That was so titan of you, sir. Alright, this thing felt really good in sixes. Granted, we did get Endless Veil, which is like a super like close range map. I was surprised how nice that was. I kind of want to try another 6v6 game now, but with Silas Executioner. To see if we can chain it, get True Sight, get Invis constantly. Because in theory, if I'm killing people that avoid debuffed, the Invis uptime should be even better, no? Okay, Endless Veil, but this time in Rumble instead of 6v6. This guy should be really nice. Ooh, there's a guy right in front. Bloodbringer. Thank you for the wall hack. Made it very easy to hit that shotgun shot. Oh, good nade. Oh, Bloodbringer here. Alright, we've got three kills. We have Invis ready. I'm gonna push that guy so bad. Now you're fighting with heart, Guardian. Nice. There's a guy over there, I saw right up and crouched. No, I keep running out early. Oh, I hadn't reloaded. That is awkward as hell. I'm going to shoot the Void Child, but I don't want to lose my Invis, because I figure this is a potential chance to get the bus going. Oh, thank God he missed. No, we could have gunned him right there. Alright, 9 Street to start this off. And this is, like, it's so good in Rumble. Wait, this works with Stylish? I'm not even going to pretend I buildcrafted this in. I had no idea that would work, but that's cool. Oh my god, I'm scared. He's going to chase. There we go. I'm on a streak right now. Only have one shotty shot. And we missed it. That's bad. No. Wait. What? I hit him, but he didn't die, I guess. Get a nade on that in case. And we get one more kill. This guy pushing B. Give him some volatile rounds. Hey, another 10 streak. Dude, he is so good. Like, obviously, it's going to excel a bit more on the smaller maps. Like, Endless Veil is perfect. But it's so much. Like, it's just crazy the kill potential with it. Like, just chaining multi kills. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I really appreciate it. I was very impressed with this build. It was very, very strong. Uh, it worked incredibly well in Rumble. A little bit cheesy, granted. However, 
Do I think I had more success with this than just running around with a crafted Ikalos or a Taraba with a Peacekeeper Titan? Probably not, and this was a fun little variety. It was a bit different. It was fun to chain the kills. Uh, please do let me know in the comments if there's any other videos you guys want to see me make. I have a bunch of stuff planned. I want to get back to daily uploading. I do really appreciate the support, and uh, I mean, I got my eyes set on that 100k, so we're definitely going to be pumping out the videos. If you enjoyed, please be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace!